Yo, 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 what's up, y'all? It's RC on Hoops, Caitlin Clark, and Iowa. So, tonight's video, we're talking about my aces. Let's go. Without further ado, right? Look, has there ever been a repeat champion to look like a team of destiny? If it hasn't, you're looking at them. The aces really, I don't even have the words. The only thing I could think of that comes to mind is sheer dominance. That's it. That's the only thing I could think of as it pertains to the Aces. Um, just a beat down night. Um, total beat down. Um, at one point we showed like, you know, we would let the Liberty back in um a couple of minutes before halftime. Liberty made a run, halftime. Adjustments got made. We came out and we just laid it on them again, put the smack down on them. Um, yeah, it's a um, it's a brilliant win. I don't know if it breaks New York spirit, but it it definitely dented their hopes. Um, we go up 2-0, final score 104-76. Um, what a game, guys. If you're an Aces fan, like I am, you're ecstatic, you're exhilarated, you understand the job is not done, though. And so you know there's one more game that's out there to get. But right now, I got to say, I I got to say, this is just absolutely incredible. And I didn't even see this coming. <laughs> I, never, I never thought that we would actually punish the New York Liberty. I thought these games would be hard fought, close, dog determined, um, brutal battles, intense fights to the end. No, this this is no epic WNBA finals, guys. This is um this is just a brutalizing fest. And um unless New York can muster up the courage to at least win one game, then season's going to be over. And as an Aces fan, look, if we win it all Sunday, I'm going live right after that. We're doing a celebration live. I'm, I'm dead ass, you know. If we sweep to, sweep to Liberty, celebration live is coming. But let me just say this, guys. Asia Wilson just putting on a clinic. Kelsey Plum, playoff Plum. She has come to play. Jackie Young, she has lived up to the moment. Kelsey Plum loves the finals. Chelsea Gray loves the moment of the finals. We're just on another stratosphere. We're just on another level. We're just in another dimension. Um, I hate to brag. I hate to come off like that because I know that Aces fans aren't the only ones to slide through here and check out the channel. But look. No disrespect, no shade to my Liberty fans, but y'all been getting y'all asses handed to y'all. So what are y'all going to do? Like John Quill Jones plays with that chip, that fierceness, that fire, that boldness that the whole team needs. Like Brianna Stewart won the MVP. You ought to give that back. You ought to get your receipt out and give it back. Because look at what's going on out here. It's been a complete travesty from a Liberty fan. New York Liberty or a New York imprisonment? Which one is really their name? And hey, y'all had a great season. And the season's not yet over. But y'all got to fight back. I hope you do. Because I love playoff basketball women's basketball, all basketball, period. And I like it if I could at least get, you know, a little bit more basketball. But, you know, hey, if y'all don't, if y'all lay down in game three, that that would just be sad. Fight back for your fans, you know. Um, hopefully the Liberty can, can, can figure out how to right the ship because, What's what we've been doing? Um, just our execution, deliberate's non-execution, um, not being able to defend, 
our guards letting Asia have her way. It's it's embarrassing. I agree. Uh, Queda, Queda Love Sports just put out a video. She said this is damn embarrassing. Well, she didn't say damn, but I'm saying damn. This is damn embarrassing. Shout out Queda Love Sports. This is hella embarrassing. What team is this? Like, Dallas played us better. Dallas played harder. What is this? This is the WNBA Finals, for crying out loud. Meanwhile, for us, y'all know my quote I've been saying all season long, covering the Aces, talking Aces. This was another day at the what? At the office. This was another day at the office. We got one more game, and we're repeating as champs, and it will be so sweet. Without Candace Parker, and we still win, right? It's crazy. It's, it's mind-boggling. Sabrina Ionescu, she hasn't shown up. And this is why she's inconsistent. Courtney Vandersloot, where are you? But Naja Laney, you showed out against Connecticut. Where are you? It's... It's um I'm not gonna say too much more. Um I'm even disappointed in the Liberty as an Aces fan. But um this is what I want to say before I get up out of here. Listening, y'all listening? Okay. Look, check it out, Aces fans. I just want us to finish them off. It would be great to get a game for, but don't play around. Because you never know what can happen. You never ever know. There's a first time for everything. Right now, teams down 0-2. They're zero and eighteen, is it? Hey, finish them off. Come on, Aces. That's what, if I'm Becky Hammond. I'm telling you, the job's not over. It ain't over. You gotta complete the mission. And Sunday, we can get them up out of here. And that's what it's supposed to be about: winning the ultimate goal. We get four more quarters. Four more quarters. That's it. Asia Wilson, Jackie Young, Kelsey Plum, and Chelsea Gray. The core four. All season, the core four have been balling, and we locked in right now. So let's just go out to New York, get that game, celebrate on their court. Who cares? Let's get it done. And with that being said, guys, this is RC. Like, share, subscribe, and I'm out to the next time. Peace.